Hallo zusammen. Hello everyone. Uh, danke für die Einleitung. Thank you for the introduction. It's possible that I sound a bit bad, uh, funny, but I have a bit of a cold. The portal went well. It's not because of that. I'll tell you a little bit about the transparency law and which content should be in it and how we implemented it during the last year. At the top, you see a long list of names. And we will show you later who worked on this. We are Universität Hamburg. We are a group at the University of Hamburg, uh, which uh, builds a colloquium of um, research organizations and commercial firms. And this time, we built it with the finance administration. First, I will go over yeah, telling you what the transparency law is, because I'm not sure that you, everybody is on the same page. Then about delivery systems and viele Daten, viele Dokumente sollen quasi irgendwo and basic decisions. Von solchen Liefersystemen For example, uh, the multiple uh, sources of documents which are uh, fed into the delivery system. Auch zu realisieren. And also how portal the portal would then be realized with those. Uh, ich I have some screenshots wo wir es angucken können und where we can see auch jetzt how it looks and you can verwenden. right now uh, use it. Model, was wir the metadata haben, model erläutern, will be explained uh, and the, 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 the architecture and RP API will be shown which allow a periodic download and what we have planned for the next two years. Das Transparenzgesetz the Transparency Law hatte hier uh, quasi diese Ziel, I had the goal Daten, of delivering uh, administrative documents and data uh, to the public. Uh, and the, uh, the target was fulfilling this by das heißt, wurde October 6, 2014. And it was decided Könnte man sonst wie machen? Das wurde quasi ein Webportal gebaut. In, a Webportal was built. Und auch mit ziemlicher, sag ich mal, Vehemenz aus der Behörde, aus der, äh, aus der Behörde heraus. Also das dann um, with a lot of um, um, das heißt trying from the authorities, um, they wanted to get it done until the deadline. Aber jetzt hier ein System werden, and it had to work auch dann funktioniert. until then. Das das the erste Transparency äh, Law, that's äh, the first article. Soll werden. The purpose äh, of the law is to provide comprehensive right to information and thus making accessible and spread all the information held by the authorities listed in the second article, article para graph, third directly to the public, personalized data excluded. And the authorities which I meant are basically all authorities. A central point in this law is uh, information, articles of information, uh, information items, so to speak. And I'm going to just read them to you. It's the preamble and uh, the, the subject of uh, choosing those items was to discover how um, uh, to present them. And it was interesting to see what the Senate would decide, what uh, the messages of the, city to, uh, the Senate of the city parliament were, and this law, this list, grew through the participation of citizens through a wiki uh, where they asked which art, uh, types of information would be interesting. interesting. So, for example, point nine, geodata, is something uh, which would be more interested to the public than the subjects above in some cases. And the goal is, there's a, a lot of different types of data, and how do we structure them? And the law said that these 15 uh, types of information, every type of, uh, of information should then later on in the portal be categorized as shown here. Aus dem, 
Gesetz raus erstehen quasi From the law itself. Anforderungen. There is a list of the de delivery uh, points which I need to be re fulfilled. So uh, andererseits waren da relativ uh, allgemeine Sometimes Zeichnungen wie Geodaten. Rather dann, generic uh, things such as geodata and then we had to decide what is meant by this and immediately wesentlich interessant dann, wenn Verträge gemacht werden. In so far interesting when contracts are concerned from the city of Hamburg with uh, interested parties, with firms, externals. There, within 30 days, one should be guaranteed to be, have the option of, of, of uh, counteracting a contract so that it can later on be published and rechtzeitig dann noch reagieren können. Das heißt, and have the ability to react. Okay. And this is most uh, relevant by, with geo geodata. The searchability is interesting in terms of metadata and full text, and uh, metadata uh, such as uh, title or, or publication date. And the goal here is to make things just easily findable. And it's important that um, older states of information have to be um, uh, supported via revisioning so that we can show historical data from a year ago and we can see and we need to show 10 years of data so that the database does support this. So starting from 2014 on for, for the next 10 years. The machine readability, default formats, vendor independence are all bases for new apps or application. Die Daten quasi verwenden sollen. Which das heißt, das eine Zielgruppe should be the basis which should base their use on the data provided. Firmen, die, die Anwendungs, uh, Anwendung schreiben. Und die anderen sind einfach Menschen, And the rest die quasi im Portal auf der Webseite. From, uh, from, uh, das heißt, die Company is the right the data. It has to be um, uh, is okay, possible. Um, and the privacy, the uh, protection of personal data um, should be um, given to protect the persons. In some way, uh, the authorities uh, didn't uh, do that before. And so they had to develop the process how to do it. Uh, on the right side, uh, you can see um, the organization system, the databases. For example, Digital Green Park. <laughs> Yeah, and all the things that are listed, they're all um, connected to a... We had 19, uh, 90 different systems of delivery, and now we have 60. Alris, uh, for example, that's the third one. Da gibt es quasi für jeden Bezirk ein Allriss-System, wo dann die Dokumente, Protokolle äh, von den Sitzungen äh, der einzelnen Bezirke veröffentlicht werden. Die And sollen aber dann verfügbar sein über das Portal. Äh, uh, also what Alris they decide in the ja. um, group. Und so Allriss is interesting. Radrouten, äh, Informationssystem. So, das the next so interesting, those are separate databases. The next interesting thing, in my opinion, is the Hardika, which is the Hamburg Metadata Catalog. It's uh, below the uh, list of uh, statistics of pupils. And with this, it was possible for an authority to describe a set of data and uh, deploy this at a certain point. Und and that's what the primary use for this was, and to make it accessible. This Handika should in dem Portal also be contained within the portal. 
Das heißt, wir haben which means that this different types of systems which deliver data. And we've created a, a term of so-called authorities which can export data but not support and save it themselves. Der Daten ist notwendig. So, Dann we need to save this data. And some authorities and some systems which can persist data and where we only need to, to fetch uh, the data by a harvesting. And then there are authorities which, which don't have any export ex at all. And in those cases, uh, new internal processes had to be developed. And uh, especially um, redaction and, uh, um, and saving of information became relevant in these cases. Und das sind diese Kernentscheidungen, von denen ich vorhin gesprochen habe. Es gab bis vor kurzem noch äh, Open Data Portal Hamburg, was quasi die Geodaten. Until recently äh, um, there was Daten Hamburg, which was the portal for um, Open Katalog. Auch geharvestet hat. Data Portal. Das heißt, es gab And wurde, äh, also the Hamburg Metadata Catalog existed for, two, for about two years ago. Aber nur mit einer von, von einem von diesem Liefersystem. With only one delivery system and not with about 60 different systems. Der letztendlich auch für mehrere steht. Der übrigens jetzt metafair.de heißt Metadatenverbund. And there is now association of metadata modeling, which why there is a rename, um, which, which will be possible for other different uh, Bundesländer to support uh, uh, their, their indexes and upload them. But that's talk in the future. We have a metadata model angelehnt an das Open Data metadata model verwendet. Das heißt, wir haben nicht nur die Informationsgegenstände, die natürlich bei dem Open Data Portal nicht vorhanden sind, die haben wir hinzugefügt, aber wir haben die Open Data Kategorien beibehalten. Uh, there are Open Data Categories, which we kept. Data Kategorien. And they are all structured, for example, um, Modell, <coughs> traffic or uh, School. And the main idea is to have one a data set and a different resources. We wanted a web portal uh, where we, you could search through the um, data sets and uh, as well an RP for the app and an art architecture. Das Portal which I will go into further now. The portal uh, itself uh, is seen right there. Uh, there, the, the search uh, point transparency. The page is transparency.hamburg.de. And the search page which supports the different delivery systems. Um, and I have searched here for the transparency portal, and we had 16 results there. So the portal portal itself has also information about itself and how it was built. For example, the process of contract uh, decision making. You can decide uh, whether you like the look and feel or not, but uh, it's a search page and here on the right here, you have the filters where you, as they are known. And here are the open data categories. Which can be seen there. And there is a detail view which contains the primary mode of actually downloading the resources. In this case, a PDF. On the right, you also see time based information and interesting Zeiten suchen, zum Beispiel. Advanced searches, which you can look for. And you can look at this. I will go further uh, into the depth of. I've said that a metadata, metadata model um, 
is based on open data. Uh, things. On the right, you have the RP field names. If you ask for something through the RP, and on the left, the German names for it. And uh, the author is the authority that uh, gave the information. The Informationsgegenstand is the, the groups are the open data categories. Sprechen für eine Ressource gibt es natürlich die Möglichkeit, dass die others um, belong to resources, um, which you can download. The offline uh, date is the date when it's going to be republished. Uh, ten years uh, a data set is supposed to stay in, and there are as well um, data sets which are uh, put in um, on free will which can be deleted earlier as well. Und das ist die and that is the architecture. Um, it looks really dramatical. Uh, really big uh, bubbles. I'm going to go to the next we picture. We have Im implemented uh, the upper green thing. Uh, search. Searching, harvesting, mapping. The delivery systems uh, don't uh, belong to the metadata scheme. In the middle, there's a full text analyze. Uh, we have done it with the tool CCAN. You might know it from the o open data uh, group. The green part take, took it from us, and especially the RP. The portal uh, can be uh, checked through the CCAN RP. CCAN is a comprehensive knowledge archive network for the open data um, group with the open Python uh, layer and a solar index. In um, governmental parts of British. Uh, and <coughs> authorities. And uh, SIGIN uh, delivers harvest possibilities where we can download the metadata to get the uh, uh, geodata on the uh, tabl tables, tables. And we analyze them with Apache TK tools. And the solar search itself uh, delivers these filters, uh, which we use to advance search. The website itself, Hamburg.de, is the design. CCAN as well has a um, UI, uh, which we had especially to um, fit to our metadata. We have built uh, advanced things for CCAN, for especially um, uh, fourteen harvesters which were written, distributed. And for example, to be uh, harvested at 1900 hours and then be uh, present at the right time and place. And the distributed running of these harvesters is efficient because otherwise we until now had always had to wait for the law uh, for the slowest systems system. Uh, highlighting is not yet possible. Uh, so, for example, if I search something and uh, the match might be coming from something in the abstract or so, it's not visible yet why and when that is matched, but in the next version it will be supported by CCAN that uh, display of highlighting. And for what we, of course, have is the harvest implementation. The API selbst. The API. Uh, Ermöglicht eben ein programmatischen Zugriff auf das Portal. Programmatic access to the portal and can be downloaded into this up, uh, web and, uh, URL and, uh, and reviewed. 
search. Und das heißt, and the search, primary search is the package search, which allows über diese API durchführen, um, search directly via the API. So it's also, for example, possible to set feeds and uh, get notified about new items. So if you want to use the API metadata schema mapping here aufgelistet, is the API I've listed it here as metadata uh, packet uh, API is the schema so this was CCAN. At the, and at the bottom right is the IT provider here in Hamburg. You can see the IT provider data pond. Which maintains what we call the central storage. And the literary export of the authorities is exported to the um, Werden, wenn man processing jetzt also system laden will, dann greift so man when you are actually um, uh, so, uh, getting a, a record you are uh, retrieving it from central storage so for secan the central storage is uh, like a, a another delivery system Enthalten. Das heißt, and this is in contained in this principle, and at any time we can rebuild the entire index as long as they are in the central storage, e even if it's not in the persistent uh, delivery system. Das war falsch. Hier. Und hier unten <coughs> das rote and at the bottom here, the red part, is the new workflow for the authorities, the das heißt, der ist employees. Dass sie bisher in der Behörde muss man archivieren, sozusagen irgendwann. Until now in the um, in the authorities you had uh, you, you you had a folder which which went uh, into the archive and now it's getting a checkbox. Move this into the transparency portal and then some additional uh, metadata has to be entered and then deletions have to. Uh, take place, and this is a workflow for every uh, employee in the wird dieser Workflow durchlaufen. In the authority, and then the workflow is executed. And it's a possibility. And the upload possibility is uh, to uh, give us information for agency sees which form externally supply us with the data. So that's already my last slide. We can start discussing soon when we can talk about the uh, tech side more. These are the topics which, from our research institute, where we're still working on the next two years, and for for this portal, for this portal. Ein wesentlicher Punkt ist Qualitätssicherung. Ein Main Point is quality assurance. For example, that everything has now a good title, and this is uh, the job of every employee and the authors. Uh, and it needs to be made sure that the harvesting process runs correctly for all sets of data. And and internally and externally from the authorities, we want to support for structured data. And I said that the um, contracts are uh, archived as PDF and they arrive at us as a PDF as well. And if you have to switch it into OpenDoc, um, we can build it in, if you like. Tell us. Excel uh, is from that company. You know, um, we could build uh, from every Excel a zip file. So if you don't have Excel, uh, you could uh, use it. And uh, mo we want to advance it more uh, to makes it possible to get feedback from the data. Um, so if you m you're missing this and this, or that and that, um, you should ask. Um, automatic metadata. Uh, there are some things which we haven't built in yet, 
data. There's some synonyms, uh, open data, GAF data, community, we've got, uh, we will uh, advance those. There are other terms which are needed support um, for mining data. If I want to have um, a summary of things, if you have uh, 50 pages, you want to have a summary. Um, so I want to have a certain information about a data set. And this topic, uh, advanced delivery systems, uh, we will build it into the next data systems. So thank you for your attention. That was uh, my part. Super. Thank you, Lothar. We have awesome. the opportunity for a Q&A session. If you have questions, there are microphones here. We have time for a Q&A session right now. Please go to the microphones. Fangen wir gleich mit dem äh, Nummer zwei an. Ja, Mikrofon zwei. Number two. Ja, funktioniert. Danke. Okay, Hier ist keine technischen Fragen, I don't have a technical äh, question, politische. but a political also one. Moment komme aus I am a person, I am from Baden-Württemberg, where Red-Green Coalition now works on an uh, Information Freedom Act. Es tut sich and nichts. Is nothing gering. has happened and the interest is low. And in uh, other federal uh, counties, um, there is much happening. happening. And the question is, are you in Hamburg just building this, working on this, or is this being looked at by other, party, uh, other counties? And is this just uh, proprietary to Hamburg and everywhere else there is blocked? And the second question is, another political one, in the transparency law, you have the, um, uh, uh, the exceptions like trade secrets and, uh, and uh, uh, external data. And, uh, and in all these federal countries, um, the authorities try to block anything they can, whoever is um, in charge. How is it? In, so the question is, how is it in Hamburg? Um, are the authorities uh, different here or are there the same blockades that are everywhere? So my first question is proprietary. Herr Taus, würden Sie sich bitte auf eine Frage davon... Please only do one question. I've added them together into one. So the first question... Um, already is posed in the way that, I mean, there are other uh, countries that f uh, have interest in it, federal countries. So, for example, NRW um, uh, is starting a new portal right now. So I see interest in our work, uh, proprietary, um, maybe um, especially because it's only uh, about Hamburg, but from the reductional side, um, I mean, our thing uh, could be used by other federal countries. Um, and the other question was, um, some authorities do it, some authorities don't. But during our project, um, there was an extra teaching um, and multiplicators um, to try to change the behavior and change the, uh, the thought, um, the idea how they are. Some stay how they are and some um, have... So the topic publishing uh, is a special one. And we only have time for two more questions and I'm going to number three. So, also, vielen Dank. Die Thank you Datenbank very much. The parliamentary database really needs to be cleaned up. If somebody ever looked at the, uh, at the UI, it's um, death. Bisschen Bedenken habe ich ja I gerade, have was some concerns angeht, die regarding, kennen, die aber regarding uh, decrees which are uh, confidential and this will 
uh, change in January and we'll all run around with toilet brushes again through Hamburg. And, uh, and um, the question here is if that would give problems within the authorities in terms of publishing information in the receipt guard. And what in the last 10 years I've read in the Hamburger Abendblatt is that is that references for to the newspaper in 1980, and uh, the problem is often that the resources there are only in scanned images instead of indexed data. And well, um, the 10 years are only now for starting now. Um, at some point, this will then better, and it can now be harvested at the portal, and it's being done now. Wenn man die Ressourcen mit harvestet, könnte man die quasi auch If you resource also harvest the resources, you could then keep those information. I can only say that something is missing, something is bad. Um, uh, let us know and. Okay, und dann kommen wir zur letzten Frage. So the last question. Okay, everybody now. Wir sind noch bei der letzten Frage. We at the last question. Let's bitte um, daher. Leise in den Raum Please kommen. be quiet. Die letzte Frage. The last question. Ja. Von hier. In Netz wurde die Frage gestell gestellt, auf welcher Entscheidungsebene in der Verwaltung What sollte über level die of decision in uh, body uh, is uh, the one where decisions are making Verwaltung. Auf welcher Entscheidungsebene? In administrative level? Hm. Kann ich nicht so sagen. I can't say. We don't know. Das ist nicht, nicht, das ist nicht für jede Behörde quasi gleich. It's not the same for uh, every authority. That's decided by every authority. If they have to publish data. Vielen, vielen Dank. Thank you very much. Die Möglichkeit, weitere Fragen und Antworten zu stellen. Possible to give further questions after the talk with the Lord directly. Outside would be best because the talk, the next talk is coming in. I thank you very much and a warm applause for Lothar. Thank you.